Well, Mikel, uh, welcome to Birmingham City. How excited are you by this new challenge? Thank you at first, and I'm really happy to to be here, and <clears throat> I wanted to be ready uh, as soon as possible to play with the team. And why did you decide to come to England and Birmingham City? Uh, it was a... Uh, uh, a big deal for us to come to, to England for me and, and my family and after uh, the things uh, in Bilbao uh, <coughs> they say to us that uh, we have to to leave for Bilbao but, so uh, we thought that uh, <coughs> the best of option for the family uh, for sure it was to come to, to England and that's the reason because we are here. I guess you would have had offers to stay in Spain and elsewhere as well? Yeah, uh, but that's uh, what I say right now. Uh, for me and for my family, after leaving Bilbao, it was uh, a better, better option to come here to England and, and it was, uh, uh, I think it, it will be really good for us. You spent 11 years at Bilbao, a, a club legend. Was it difficult, uh, emotional to leave? Yes, I think it's always uh, really hard to leave uh, your house around 11 years, uh, a, a, a place that I feel like my house, like I, I spent uh, 11 years in the first team, I've been two years before in, in under 16, under 17, and, and it's like being at, at home, so it's always hard to, to leave, uh, really emotional, uh, after 11 years a lot of teammates that uh, I played with, with them, but uh, things are like that, so now it's a, a new challenge. I'm really happy, really excited, and, and I, I, I wanted to, to start. <clears throat> and what do you make of Birmingham City and the squad Ator Karanka is building, is assembling? Yeah, I think uh, all the projects that uh, Aitor started, uh, they are really interesting. Uh, teams, team uh, right now starts really well in in championship in the first two league games. So I think the the project is really interesting. The the team is uh, doing really good, and I will try to to give my best to help them to to get the the object. Was the head coach a big influence on you coming here? Yeah, I think so. Uh, finally, uh, I thought is the is the coach, he knows me, and all the, the things that we talk about, uh, he transmits me a lot of confidence to come here, and, and it's a big important thing that, that we, uh, for me to be here. Obviously, the, the way we play in England, uh, in the championship, the sort of physicality and the demands of the league, that's of no concern to you. you you'll adapt. Yeah, I think so. Uh, I've been playing in Bilbao that we are really a physical team, so I think uh, it will be uh, similar. I always try to do and give my best and, and my 100% in, in all the games, so I will try to, to do it the same here because that's uh, how i always uh, been playing football. Of course, you have been here before. Um, at Liverpool when you were 18 and, and 19, did did you ever think that you'd come back to England? I didn't know. Uh, I I never expect because uh, once uh, I, I've been in in Bilbao for a long years, uh, in my mind a lot of times uh, I think about uh, being forever, uh, uh, taking a retire in, in Bilbao, but things change and and after leaves, uh, after leave Bilbao, I think uh, I'm young. I, I think I have uh, still more years to play football, and that's why uh, we are here. I'm here, and I will try to to fight for this club. What kind of player would you say you are? What qualities can you bring to the team? Always my hundred uh, percent. I think. Uh, uh, I'm physical, uh, I have a uh, good header, I, I train to, to give my best and 
I think uh, that's uh, the most important thing. And we know you've played central defensive midfield role in the most recent seasons, but you can also play at, at centre half. Yeah, I think so. But uh, I, I think that I am a better player playing in the in the midfield. I played at the beginning, at first in central half. After that, with Ernesto Valverde, I I go through for for the midfield, and I think uh, that that it's there uh, where my best things and my my best potential uh, have been in the pitch. So I think. Uh, midfield is the, the better. And you were uh, a leader at Bilbao. Hopefully, you can bring those leadership qualities to the team in Birmingham City as well. Yeah, I think so. I think that uh, always uh, the things I've been doing, uh, I will try to to keep doing, to follow doing the same, to be, to try to be in, uh, to be the, the same person as I have been. And if I, I if if I am the, the same person and if I I try to to do my best and and to do it the best, I think it will be okay. Now, are we going to see you score from the centre circle <laughs> like you did against Barca in that Super Cup? I don't know. It's always in my mind. Uh, uh, it's a football situation. It's a situation on the pitch. Uh, that time was okay. I never tried. Uh, again, so I don't know if the situation demands that on the pitch. I will, I will try and I will do it. Uh, I, I, that's uh, something like you have to feel it in the moment. It's not, uh, it's not that uh, you wake up and I will throw from the central line. It, it was a moment and it was fantastic. The supporters here uh, have got very excited in anticipation uh, of your signing. What would your message be to them? The same. Uh, I'm here to do the best uh, for the team, for the club, for the fans and I will try to to do it. Uh, I'm here to to do it and and to feel you all the fans really happy with me. Mikel, thank you very much for your time and speaking to us on Blues TV and we wish you very the very best of luck.